What's happening, everyone? Welcome back to another episode of Boba and Basketball, the show where I talk about my two favorite kind of balls, Boba and Basketball. I'm in San Diego, California today in Point Loma. Food, Boba, Basketball, in that order. You guys already know what's happening. But um, I'm super excited. I'm currently in Liberty Market. It's a great place in Point Loma where you can get food, lots of great spots, very local vendors. Super excited to get some food. I'm going to get uh, empanadas at a place called Parna Empanadas. Uh, I'm not feeling too hungry, so I just want to take a little light. And then we're gonna go get some boba at a place called Tea Sweet, one of the only boba places in Point Loma. And then we're gonna go to Point Loma Nazarene University to watch the sea lions take on the Dominican University penguins. I hope you guys are hungry. Hope you guys are excited. I'm super excited to be here. I'm so happy to be back. Let's do a video. I'll get empanadas and I'll see you guys back in the car. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm back in the car. So um, I got myself a chicken chipotle and a mushroom empanada. Let's take a look at these guys. Oh my goodness, these guys look beautiful. They look so crispy, so golden. Also got it with a chipotle chimichurri sauce. Um, that's what the lady said I should get. So I'm gonna try this. All right, guys, let's go for our bite. Let's get some sauce on there. Oh my goodness, it looks so pretty. So this is the mushroom, definitely the mushroom one. Mmm. Oh, this is really good. Look at the inside. Look at that filling, guys. Mm. I love mushrooms. The mushroom flavor of this is incredible. There's so many, it's, there's different, definitely different types of mushroom. It's very soft. It's very warm. A little too doughy for my taste, I'll say that. A little bit too doughy, but otherwise, the mushroom one is really good. Oh my goodness, guys. After this, I'm gonna try the chicken chipotle. <laughs> All right, guys, so um, <laughs> I said I got the chicken chipotle. So I got, <laughs> I got a chick, I got a beef one, but this was for my girlfriend, but the lady didn't specify which one was which, and I forgot to ask. So instead, the one I got is a Maldic beef. And this is really good. <laughs> but um, I feel so bad now, but because I really love chicken, I was super excited to try the chicken one. But I have this beef one that is also really good. That beef is so savory inside. Oh my goodness. Mm. So juicy and so delicious. Oh my gosh, this is incredible. I, this is a great place. Okay, this is so good. I love the beef, it is so perfectly seasoned. I love the meat, it's soft. Again, I feel like it needs a little more filling because you can see there's kind of a lot of air, but nonetheless, the beef flavor is so good and the and the actual empanada wrap is really good. So this is a recommendation, highly recommended. It's called Parana Empanadas. It's down in Liberty, Station, Liberty Market in Point Loma. I highly recommend you guys check this out. And when I finish this um, empanada, we're gonna go make our way to Tea Sweets and get ourselves some boba. I'll see you guys there. Second Street video, I got the name of the mobile place wrong in the intro. It's called Tease Moment, not Tea Sweet. Which means I need to read before I do these intros because I'm stupid, but at least I got the boba. So um <laughs> meet you guys back in the car. Okay, tonight's boba, a light shade green tea with boba, 50% sweet. I'm trying to do every video a different drink. So I'm sorry some of these are really basic, but I like the place. It's so cute. I was like, it is very very not not what I expected for this place to look like for like a very an Asian place. Like, so I don't know. It was really, it was very cute. Very felt a little old, more old school. But like, I like the decor. I like the design. The lady was really sweet that took me over there. But um, first drink of the first taste of the drink. Hell yeah! Lychee drinks are the best. 
I love lychee. I love like the occult, you know, like lychee fruit teas. This is really good. I gotta try the boba. Hmm. There's like lychee chunks in here. Mm. This is awesome. I, I, I vibe with this. This is a really cool, it's very simple. This is the, probably one of the best lychee like green teas I've ever had. It's to say there aren't a lot that I've had, but the ones I've had, this is one of the best. It's so sweet, or perfectly sweet. I love the tea. The lychee flavor is so good. I love the pulp. Any, I love pulp too. Of all juices, I love pulp. And boba is not too sweet either. It doesn't feel like it's coated in brown sugar or like honey or whatever, you know, some of those places you usually use. This was just perfect. And I like this a lot. I give this lychee green tea eight boba balls out of 10. This is rad. So I'm gonna finish up this drink, guys, and I'm gonna make my way over to Point Loma Nazarene University. I'll see y'all there. I'm inside Golden Gymnasium on the campus of Point Loma Nazarene University. This is Division II basketball. So they do things a little differently here, like have the women's play first. <laughs> so um, I'll give you guys a little highlights of this. All right, so when I started filming the ladies game, it was 66-47 with five minutes left in the game. And then the, the Sea Lions, they made it interesting. They cut the lead down to 11. They scored eight straight to make it 66-55 with about two minutes left. But um, they couldn't get anything offensively in those last two minutes. And the ladies of the Dominican won 68-59. But um, it was fun to watch that game for a little bit. Um, I think it's cool how they do it. They have the women's for play first and then the men. Uh, like I said, Division 2 is a little different. That's, what I, that's probably one of the few different things. But um, the, the men are warming up. I hope you guys are excited because I'm excited too. Division 2 basketball, guys. Oh, 
there's actually cheerleaders at this game. I'm pretty sure they didn't get the memo that I was coming. <laughs> Alrighty, at the end of the first half point, Loma has the lead 37-33 for the fourth straight game. We might have a close finish, so I'm super excited again. Uh, I'd also like to say this is not my first time on the Point Loma University campus, but I actually haven't been here since eighth grade. Cue the picture. I still look the same. <laughs> One more thing I wanted to point out about, about this gym. Um, Martin Luther King Jr. Yes, the Martin Luther King Jr. When he came to San Diego for the first and only time in his life, he came inside this gym. And I think that's pretty cool. That, that, that's pretty cool, yes. Point Loma wins this one 72 to 60. Oh my gosh, that was a really fun atmosphere. Super fun game. Point Loma played awesome. And I love this gym. This is such a cool gym. This is probably like my favorite venue. That was awesome. And this was cool. I was really happy. And like, I hope I get to expose some Division II basketball because, you know, Division II players can play. They can play. They're better than me. They're better than you. <laughs>
But that's going to do it for today's episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Go check out Liberty Market. Go check out Team Moment. And go check out Point Loma Nazarene Basketball at Golden Gymnasium. I'll see y'all at the next game. Oh, 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 o